Well, struggling to sleep in this heat, sleep expert and the founder of Baby's Best Sleep, Amanda Jusen, has some really cool ideas. And that's <laughs> because so many people don't have air conditioning. It's true. And so we're going to talk about some very economical ways to make sure that you're staying cool. I love the the pun there. So first I like to talk about what's actually on our bodies. Mm -hmm. So we're thinking about jammies and sheets. If you want to take a look at these guys here, we're going to swap out our duvet for a nice cotton um, quilt instead. Okay. That's going to be very right. light. Yes, so light, so nice. We want to think about the quality and the fabric of our sheet. So here we have bamboo and I have low thread count cotton. So okay. often what we're talking about when you think about sheets, we think about those luxurious high high thread count. Ooh, Egyptian thread exactly. count, right? Exactly. The exact opposite. We want something low, breathable for that air to breathe right through. So bamboo is great, low thread count cotton. You want to consider the um, the type of fabric for your jammies as well. These mm -hmm. guys are bamboo, same, same. Okay. Then, Okay, we've done, we've we've figured out our body yeah, because you still want something on you. Yes, right? I, I always do. I yeah, can't I do. sleep without something. But then your mattress might be the problem if you're still hot. So people are really getting into cooling mattress pads. So the first guy I have here, this is actually made of bamboo. I keep talking about bamboo because it really is that breathable it material. Wicks too, That's right? right. It wicks. If you're sweating, it's going to wick that away. It's going to allow the airflow. Airflow is key. And then we have gel cooling mattress pad. So feel this, feel so this it. Is, this is kind of freaky because <laughs> it is cool. Immediately, Immediately. Right? So people think it's kind of false advertising, but legitimately the gel pulls the heat from your body it, it immediately. So if you're, you know, in that spot and you feel, oh, you know, I'm a bit warm, you're gonna get a cool spot immediately upon Just rolling, rolling over. over which okay. is amazing. All right. Then this looks ridiculous, but it works, okay? This is a DIY air conditioner. You can simply pop in ice. You get two little pop bottles here. I have poked holes here, a couple of zip lines on the back of your fan, and then... Oh, zip ties here, okay. Yep, yep. there's zip ties right here. I have some pipe cleaners to hold the ice. You pop the ice in, turn on the fan, and you will have cool air blowing on your face. And the reason why it works is it pulls the hot air in order to melt the ice. Another alternative way is simply just to blow a fan over ice. Now, it is a bit ridiculous, but if you live in a small apartment, you don't have air conditioning, mm -hmm. this is massive. Can you just turn that around again Absolutely. just so that we can show? So I wondered, I thought the pipe cleaners in here were like for decorations, but it's, yes. just, it's to hold the ice so the ice Correct. doesn't go down into the bottom of it. And, and then you've got when it melts, holes poked in there. Yeah, That's right. When it melts, you just open this and drain out the water to okay. reuse the next night. And then do you have the fan, um, do some fans direct mm -hmm. away or... Mm -hmm. Oh, I see what you mean. Yes, you'll want this on you okay. for sure. So you want it just, and again, it's not going to cool down your whole entire apartment or the whole room. But it'll make that room That's bearable. right. It'll just make you... Keep it on you. Exactly. Finally, you're still hot. I get it. We've all been there. You're just going to take a quick bath or a shower. That's it. Immediately in the shower, your body temperature goes down. You're going to be able to fall asleep. And if you do all the things that I tell you, you're going to stay asleep. Right. We were talking as, as kids, like, we, neither of us had air conditioning. No. So it would be like, I remember my mom, like, just taking a, a washcloth. Yes. And just kind of putting it in cold water, wringing mm -hmm. it out, and then that's what you'd put on your face. You'd put it, you know, Totally. Wherever. Well, our bodies work really hard all night to lower our body temperature. Um, if you are too hot, and the reason why we can't sleep when we're too hot is your body will signal you all night to wake up, wake up, cool down, wake up, cool down. So if you are struggling in the middle of the night, truly none of these things are working, going into the shower, taking a nice lukewarm or cool shower, right. it's going to do the trick for you immediately. Okay. It really does help. All right. Going to use all of these. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Thanks, Good. Amanda. We'll get all the socials up and more details at chch.com slash morning live.